Okay, I'm here. Sorry I'm late, guys. I had to go live from my phone. It wasn't letting me do it on the computer. I got to download software now. So apparently you can't, you can't stream from your computer without software, guys. All right, so I'm going to wait for some people to get in here. I got all set up inside. I had my guitar set up. I was like, I'm just going to play guitar until people start coming in. You know, maybe I should just run and go grab it still. I don't know. I don't know. But I got the mic set up. Hey, what's up, JP Vending? How's it sound, man? I got, I was able to hook my mic up. PlayStation sucks. Yeah, dude, totally. Totally. We got Lonzo Lude in the house. You guys, you guys. What's up? Quick play. So what's up, everybody? Dang, everybody hopped in here super fast. So we got uh, Vin Biz, uh, Lonzo's Loot, Isaiah Robinson, Charles Kaiser, Quick Play, Parker Thompson, Vin Biz, Dakota Hall. What's up, guys? So, dude, did you guys know that you can't stream from your computer without software now? I never know. I never knew. I never knew that. I never knew that. So, man, you guys are awesome. We're all in here. Uh, I was having a little trouble. That's why I was late. So I'm kind of a little flustered still. It might take me a second to get back organized. But uh, yeah, so we're back. And um, I was going to give you guys a little update on my truck. I got my truck is a big old issue. And I was editing a video today. And I thought I was going to be able to get it out. But I don't think I'm going to be able to get it out until, um, until tomorrow. So I figured, hey, why not check in with everybody? See how everyone's doing. See what everybody's getting into. Let's go. We got Justin from Forever Self-Employed in here. Oh, yeah, Rumble. Oh, you just hit 115. Awesome, dude. Yeah, I'm like up at 380. I haven't really given it much love this last week just because with all the drama with my truck and I'm behind on uh, uploads for the video or the video uploads for YouTube. So uh, I've just been working, man. I've been working a lot, not really focusing on Rumble, but yeah. Rumble, I, I got like 20 sponsors on my music channel. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to really focus on that music channel and just upload videos. Um, yeah. So that's the plan for the Rumble. Uh, the truck's going to cost me like 3500 bucks to get, uh, I'm going to get a new motor in the truck because, so here's the deal. When I took the truck in, uh, I knew it was a head gasket. So I went and got a second opinion thinking I might be able to get a cheaper price. And uh, this guy, it was the same thing, same situation. So... The, the second mechanic, though, didn't think it was a head gasket, which is so crazy because, like, I knew it was a head gasket. I'm not a mechanic or anything. I'm pretty handy, but I'm not a mechanic. So I tell him, hey, blah, blah, blah. I think I kind of explained it in my last video. Long story short, my truck has 195, almost 200,000 miles on it. And uh, to put a new head gasket, it was like 2,500. So for, like, another 800 bucks, I could just get a brand new engine. So I'm just going to put a stupid brand new yeah, third opinion, <laughs> you're so right. But dude, I ain't got time. It's already been two weeks. I mean, it's like my, my wife works, so we only have to two vehicles. So it's it's been brutal, man. I've been using the old Chevrolet legs. You know, my legs are I've just been walking. So it's good. It's It's been nice. It's been nice. Yeah, I hope it don't break it down again. Yeah, the Dodge Ram is. It's an okay truck. It's all right. It's my first uh, truck. Sorry. This is, this is uh. Streaming from the phone. This is weird, man. This is way different. This is like my rumble set. This is like my little setup for the rumble. I guess I could start doing this for the YouTube too, but I usually like have the camera facing that way. But I don't know. So sounds good. I always want to look at the mic. Like when I have the mic out, I want to look at the mic. So I left all my notes and everything inside that I wanted to go over, you guys. So we're almost at 2,500 subs, which is crazy cool. Um, hey, son, this ain't Brenda. It's your dad. Oh, <laughs> what's up? Hey, everybody. My dad, Brenda, is in the chat. Say what's up to my dad, Brenda. <laughs> you mentioned me in my last video. Yeah, I saw it. Wait, the last, last video? Yeah, I remember I talked to you about that. Spit some bars? Okay, um, oh, I just got to have my guitar. I'll spit some bars, dude. I'll go run and grab my guitar if you guys are cool with it. It'll take me like two seconds, man. I'll spit some bars. My dad's name's Ty. T-Y. So here's a, here's a cool fun fact about my name, you guys. So... Growing up, I used to get a lot of crap from people because they think that I changed the Y in my name to like be cool or whatever because I was like a 90s kid. But there's actually, I had nothing to do with it. So Brenda, my dad, he uh, he wanted me to be a junior. He pitched that to my mom. He couldn't close the deal. So instead, I got a Y in my name because his name's Ty. So instead of me being a junior, he just slid his name into the middle of my name. 
amongst other things, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so, hey, just give me like a thumbs up, you guys, on the thing. If so, you're so you're in two videos. Yeah. Oh, two videos. Okay, I haven't. I haven't. Brandon B's in the house. Lonzo, all right. I have to get back and check. Like I said, I've been lagging on uh, watching everybody else's stuff. I've been su super busy, just more paint. So that brings me to another thing uh, with the channel. I'm going to be posting some more like paint videos. So I hope you guys are all right with that because technically it is like a side hustle vlog. It's not really a vending vlog. So I hope you guys are cool with it. But I, I got to get out there and make some dollars, dude. And the painting brings in the money quickly. So I just really got to, uh, this next month or two, I'm probably going to try to pick up a lot of more jobs, you know, maybe just pick up more jobs, you know, bid them to get them. Because sometimes I bid jobs high because I don't want them. And if, um, if I do get them, then it's worth it, if that makes any sense. Some jobs are just like a headache. And, and nowadays with all my, the way my lifestyle is now, it's changed a little bit. This last year has been a big whirlwind for me. A lot of things have changed in the last year. My wife went to work. So then I started working less, started focusing on like YouTube and like different side hustles and stuff. But now we ran into a little financial issue. So um, we're going to have to, uh, we're going to have to uh, get back out there and do some painting, dude. So let me see. Let me get back in the chat so I don't block the camera. This is where all the cool folks hang out. Yeah, we all hang out together, man. We all try to get over to each other's channel and spread some love. Couldn't close the deal. Yeah, I couldn't close the deal, so I got a cool name instead, which is probably better. Randy B's in the house. Parker Thompson. Justin, Forever Self-Employed. I'm sure everybody in this chat already knows that Forever Self-Employed has a uh, podcast with young entrepreneurs and sh shakers and movers. Make sure you go sub. Tony from VinBiz, Dakota. Painting is satisfying to watch like Justin's pressure washing channel. Real chill. Quick play, so... To be honest, I used to do a lot of paint videos, but they were more of like um, paint tutorial type of videos. But then Justin like really encouraged me, man, do some dang time lapse of your painting, bro. So he he takes all the credit for that. I mean, I just I just do it, you know. Grabbing my axe. Oh yeah, I'll go grab it. I'll go grab the. Okay, I'll go grab it. All right, my dad wants me to go grab. Post whatever you're doing. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, Ramon's lawn care. So. uh yeah, satisfying watching quick play pool big stacks. Heck <laughs> of true. Uh, so Ramon's Lawn Care. I actually have picked up, no joke, two accounts where I'm going to start doing uh, blow and goes or blow, uh, yeah, blow and uh, mow and blow. So, <laughs> so in the paint industry, we call it blow and goes where you just go in, you paint it real quick and get out because some people just want a real quick paint job. They don't want a quality job. So we call those blow and goes. But I got two clients uh, that got some investment properties and I was like, hey, let me do the, let me do the lawns, you know? So I actually got two accounts where I'm going to do mowing blows. So, yeah, stay tuned Stay tuned for those videos, man. All right, I'm going to go grab my axe, bro. I'm going to go grab my axe like a spit bars for... Oh, Jaime. Dude, Jaime's in the chat, you guys. Dude, I really appreciate that with the donation, man. I super appreciate you, dude. Dude, all the whole crew's in here. This is cool. So this is almost like our, this is almost like our Facebook chat. Dakota, you sent me two bucks, dude. Dude, that's all going into the truck fund. So I can hopefully get those machines in January. So I was going to buy some machines in January. I had my eyes set. And um, I have a claw machine like that I really, really want to get. But it's going to cost like a few grand, which is what I ended up having to spend on my guitar. Or my guitar, my truck. All right, guys. Um, don't bail out, dude. I'm going to run in the house and grab his guitar so I spit some bars for Parker. All right, man. All right, so I'm back. You guys are freaking amazing with the donations. That is amazing. Damn, Justin sent me three bucks too. Yeah, Jamie. Jaime, you did, man. Jaime really did. Oh, damn, dude. Are you guys crazy with this freaking donations right now? Whew. A money train, go figure. Okay, so here's a little funny uh, Save the Turtles, you guys. By the way, my daughter told me I needed to say that in one of my videos. All right, I'm going to spit some bars for Parker. I'm all out of breath now. Yeah, I run. Okay. Uh, <sighs> Mr. Never Shy Guy, probably. <clears throat> okay. Mr. Never Shy Guy. Wait. 
Missing never shy guy, probably coming off route. First impression, feel free to misplace or lose it. I'm out of breath, guys. Missing never shy guy, probably coming off route. First impression, feel free to misplace or lose it. Once you get to know me and you realize I'm giving the gift, the gift of the giving, I'm using it. Fine line lines between driven and delusional. Usual tactics, a post meditated, fully medicated. Who was lighting vitamins yesterday and tonight again? Situation tends to get ridiculous when I'm inside of city limits and I'm sipping whiskey. Said, oh no. I heard him say, oh no. Situation tend to get ridiculous when I'm inside of city limits and I'm sipping whiskey. Heard him say, oh no. Yeah, I heard him say, oh. oh. Missing never shy guy, probably coming off rude. First impression, feel free to misplace or lose it. Once you get to know me and you realize I'm giving a gift, the gift that I'm giving, I'm using it. Fine line, line between driven and delusional. Usual tactics, a post meditated, fully medicated. Who was lighting by the man yesterday and tonight again? Situation tend to get ridiculous when I'm inside of city limits and I'm sipping whiskey. Said, oh no. Yeah, I heard him say, oh. oh. Situation tend to get ridiculous when I'm inside of city limits and I'm sipping whiskey. Heard him say, oh no. Yeah, I heard him say, oh no, here comes him on. I don't know. Anyways, some impromptu. It's like a, uh, that's actually like a rap verse, but I just um, played on guitar, you know, I've been trying to like do that. That's kind of what I've been doing on Rumble anyways, like take my old rap. Wait a second. $32? What the? F Shut up. Shut up, dude. Shut up, dude. Dude. Dude, you guys are fucking awesome, dude. Oh. You guys are awesome. Brandon, yes, we got a jam again. Man, you guys made me all shaky and goosebumpy, dude. You guys are great, dude. I love you guys. So, I'm getting a new GoPro, so check this out. With my stupid time lapses, man, you guys got my heart all pumping, man. You guys are awesome, dude. Call me off guard with that. Those donations are awesome. You guys are amazing, dude. Um, oh, You guys threw me for a loop. Okay, so... I want to talk about the GoPro. So, okay, I got a GoPro. Um, here, look, you guys, I mean, I'm shaking and stuff, you dorks. Okay, anyways, so I got to go. What? You guys are going to make me cry, dude. What the heck's going on here? Okay, so I got a GoPro for Christmas. I asked for a GoPro, and uh, I got, because uh, I've been using a Hero 3, you guys, for all my time-lapse stuff. And I feel limited and stuff, you know, and I tried using it for, like, to do, like, the Jamie Farnsworth style for my um vending stuff so anyways i asked santa uh for a, a hero and I, I i was talking to justin about it and i decided to go with the seven because it's like 100 199 bucks or whatever like the cheap cheap one but i found out you can't really like hook a microphone up to it so um i was watching some videos and uh, santa was watching over my shoulder and and she went back and and straight got the other one for me i think so i think i don't know but anyways i'm gonna have some more dope footage coming in because I'm going to have a doper camera. And even the 7 is super awesome. The only thing that I was kind of bummed about the 7 is you can't hook a mic. But I, I found out that you can you can hook up a mic. You have to just buy... um, Because it has like two of these attachments. So you could buy... A, it's like an audio box. So you click that in. Which is kind of cool. Because my buddy Andrew has a, the new GoPro. And he has a microphone on there with like a dead cat. But you could totally see the dead cats like in the frame. So, so stay tuned. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and all that. Because I'm going to have some... Uh, I'm going to have some uh, better quality footage coming, guys. And then, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn, dude, Ray is you guys. I freaking love you guys. Yeah, let's get Mr. Beast in here to buy a new truck. Yes, please. Just fix my truck. I don't need a new truck. I just, 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 if I get mine fixed and back. Oh, my dad, my dad will match the highest donation. What? My dad's going to match the highest donation, guys. He's a rich kid. No, he's not. Raise you. <laughs> oh, easy airbrush. What's up, bro? Glad you made it over. I could play some more music for you guys if you want. I just bought a new cup. I'm shaking so much. I can't even, like, scroll the chats here. New Mexico Refuge Trucks is in the house. Man, Raise, I appreciate you so much, man. If it wasn't for you, I wouldn't even be in this whole... I wouldn't even know any of you guys, man. It's just like the... It's just amazing, dude. Got so many like-minded people. Isaac Condor, welcome to the chat, dude. Glad to have you in here. So, man, I had a bunch of stuff I want to talk about, and you guys just totally threw me for a loop, man. Crazy. 
So, um, save the turtles. Save the turtles. Make sure you drink a hydro flask. So, yeah, I started that Rumble account. And it was doing really good. I think it might have actually helped out with some subs and stuff because um, there's a there's a part on there that says other, and usually the like the um, external traffic sources said uh, um, what dude Mark Dark dude, oh my god dude, oh my god you guys are freaking messing me up dude. I might have to play some more guitar just to calm down. But uh, what was I saying? Uh, oh, you guys are throwing me off balance, dude. Um, um, what was I saying? Can I can I back up and figure out what I was just gonna say? Um, Rafa Caro, I don't know Rafa Caro. I know a little bit of Sublime, barely. I think I just learned it. So Dakota Hall, yeah, you got the Hero Seven Silver is great. Uh, so Dakota Hall said, so Dakota Hall says, Hero Seven Silver is great, but yeah, it's very limited. I like it though. So I think what I, if. If I still just get the Hero 7, I think I'm going to be stoked on that. I think um, I just want to get all the gadgets so I can hook it up and set it up in certain ways. Um, I think it would be cool to do some of my vending collections that way because, uh, to be honest, they're easier to edit for me anyways because I just get caught up and I think I add too much to my videos. I probably add too many, too much music and too many cuts and too much wacky stuff going on. So that's kind of what I wanted to talk about. Yeah, the channel. So... I'm going to change up the editing a little bit, you guys, just to mainly save some time and get more content out. So, um, you know, I, the things I'm going to do is like, I'm just not going to probably like use as much animations and stuff because maybe it's distracting. I'm just going to try to focus on making the actual like footage more interesting too. Um, also with the, with the soda machines, um, I'm switching it up. So I got a lot of sodas in the soda machines and everything, but the one location, man, is killing it with the energy drink. So I'd like to have the machine to where I could leave it on location for about two weeks because I really don't need to be going every single week to collect from them because I'm like pulling 20, 30 bucks and it's kind of a bummer, right? So what I want to do is get them stacked up with the energy drinks because I know that these guys want energy. I could literally do four rows energy drinks and the rest sodas and I think I could let the machine chill for like two weeks before I got to go back. My main objective is to get another claw machine. Now, <laughs> I've been really working hard towards getting this dang claw machine and then you know I was throwing a stick or a, a, a wrench in the gears you know I guess they say so I, I'm still gonna get one I want to get one of those nicer ones because I like to put put it in a nicer location like the one I got does good right and I watch I watch Eli I watch Eli Cody's channel and I'm just like man that that's really I would love to get more into that I tossed around the idea about maybe starting a small arcade here in my town I got a couple people that like like the idea, but I got to do the footwork and I got to write up a plan and like a proposal to really make it happen. So if you guys have any, anybody out there has any experience with that, writing up proposals and like, because dude, I'm horrible. I'm horrible at that stuff. And you know, I guess I could learn it, but something would have to sacrifice. Either it'd be work or YouTube or my family or something, you know, so, so, something's got to give. You can't, I can't. I can't just, I can't do, I can't do everything. Is it blurry? It looks blurry. Oh, geez. Where do we go? So, let me catch up on the chat here with you guys. Uh, so, Hero 7, so, um, forever. <laughs> nah, you're good. You're good, Justin. Don't even trip. Hey, man, dude, I really appreciate you. <laughs> you started a wildfire here. I appreciate that. Uh, Dude, I know that would be insane, dude. That would be absolutely insane. Thanks, thanks, Dakota. I, I think like what I mean by changing the um, D Dakota says the edits are great, um, but yeah, I think uh, just like less, you know, not less, less busy, right? Because here, here's where I'm at. I I'm starting to learn Adobe. I'm starting to make the crossover. I've been working on it the last couple weeks. I got a couple videos that I'm just working on on the computer so that's why i've been kind of lagging on uploads because i'm trying to learn this dang adobe so once i get better at it you know i won't probably use the flashy stuff i'll probably be move into a whole new area of like effects and you know making the video look cool and stuff so that's kind of my my plan for that so let me get caught up on this uh 
Brandon Beats, good idea. Less editing, more content. Yeah, a little something more smooth, you know. Isaac Condor. Uh, Isaac Condor says, we're all here because we love you and your vids, and we love your edits, dude. Awesome, dude. Okay, well, shoot, man. Maybe I'll find a happy medium. You know, I think that's just what I'm trying to do. My dad says, content, son. You are the content. <laughs> but I'm not always. Sing Fresa Rigida. I don't know how to say, I don't know that song. Sorry, Ramon's long hair. Uh, dude, I'm thinking about doing half monsters and half coke. <laughs> dude, honestly, right? It would make so easy, too. The inventory, I would keep my inventory would stay down. You know what I mean? So, dude, I'm thinking about doing half monsters, though. Jaime Abena says, I'd save a few hundred more to buy an actual camera if you're going to buy a GoPro. Oh, man. Throw me for loops left and right. I know I really do, man. Cause, dude, that last video you did, Jaime, with uh, Aaron... Dude, when you were like doing the cinematic shot in the very beginning with the uh, with the claw machine, I was just like, "Damn, dude, it looks so sick!" Mm -hmm. Like, thought I was in a movie theater, dude. No joke. The camera you got, ugh. So you so you're saying, if I'm spending two to three hundred on a camera, might as well spend five hundred on a, a, a legit legit camera. Because the GoPro mainly, I got the GoPro for like the. Uh, the painting content, like I strap it on my head, get some POV stuff, and kind of mix it in with my vlog style type type stuff. I'll sing it, Lonzo. You know the song? Is it like mariachi or is it like um mm -hmm. like country? I don't. You have to let me know. I don't know. I I don't really know how to play guitar. Okay, you can sing it. I wish this was like Instagram and people could hop in the stream. Yeah, that would be cool. I would love that. We'll make that video happen sooner or later. Yeah. Honorbox King over here. Vin Biz. Donald Newman. What's up, my man? The vending community is the best community. Hands down. So Justin from Forever Self and Play said the vending community is the best community. Oh, dude. Dominic Von Barbado just dropped a uh, just dropped the video. But don't leave. Don't leave yet. Or you can leave. That's fine. You can come back. We'll be here for a minute. As long as my phone doesn't die. I got 40%. I could plug it in to charge, but I got the microphone hooked in. So if I plug the phone in to charge, the mic's going to sound goofy. Uh, thanks, Ramon. Dude, I, I love that you're here. That's a real one. You've been around for a long time. It's a band. I'll have to look it up after. I'll Google it. I'll see if I can learn it. So I got to be honest. Like People think I know how to play guitar, but really I just know how to write songs. So like... Like, I can't really play guitar. Like, I've had people approach me, like, can you teach me how to play? And I'm like, honestly, like, when I first started playing guitar, I just pushed one string. And just do like that. So, like, my first 20 songs was like that. And then I had a buddy. He was actually a guitarist of a band I was in. <laughs> Showed me how to do a power chord. So, you know, you just do that one finger, but then you just skip a fret and drop down a string. And I got a chord. Oops. So, if you could just get, get your hand to stick... So, dude, I, that's it. I do power chords. I know a few open chords, and I made up a few, like, of my own chords. So, I don't know. But, yeah, I like playing guitar. It's fun. And when I first started YouTube, dude, this thing sat in the case for so long. So, the last couple months, I've been busting her back out. I'm going to start playing some shows here again, too, pretty soon. I'm going to wipe the lens, all right? Don't freak out. Is that any better? That's probably worse. I don't know why it's like that. Let me see if I can wipe the screen, guys. Or the stupid lens, man. It's all jacked up. Is that better? Oh, yeah. I see it had face slime on it. Dang face grease. No one can compare to Jaime quality. Dude, I agree. Dude's got some skills for sure. Oh, my God. Jamie, I was laying my all at the end when you gave him the giant gummy worm. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Dude, every time you guys bust out that gummy worm, dude, I was like, okay. <laughs> Mercado, where you been, dog? Dude, where you been at? Where you been at? I know you were talking about you're going to switch the game up, dude. So, man, I miss you, dude. What's going on over here? Yeah, Mark Mercado, man, he's been ghost. Hopefully everything's going good with you, bro. Maybe a good use that camera. I don't know what that means, Dad. You got big fingers. You need to be more careful. 
Get her. Dakota Hall, what's up, Mark? What's up, Mark? Everybody saying what's up, Mark? Not you, Mark. Not Mark Dark. Mark Mercado, bro. Play paparazzi or whatever you named it. Learn to swim. Well, those are those are two different songs. I can do learn to swim. Hi, friends. I miss you all. Yo, Justin, I'm going to call you, bro. I see you. Love you. Yeah, dude. I hope you're doing okay, Mark. Much love, brother. Uh, dude, I bug Justin every day. Oh, Chris is in here. So you guys see Villadote in the chat? So uh, Villadote is actually the guy, Chris. And he makes some music for this channel, too. So the song, Gravity, that you guys like a lot, that's his beat, man. He produced that whole song. All I did was talking to a mic. Everything else, it's all him. It's all him. I'm trying to get Justin on that one. Easy airbrush. So, yeah, Villa Dope. What's up, Chris? The Bulls. Come over. You should just come over, dude. <laughs> I've had about two guitars, but have had no clue what to do. Okay. So, Ed, I'm telling you right now, man, this is what you do. You get your guitar. You make sure it's tuned, right? And tuning is easy. There's a lot of, there's even apps. There's all kinds of free apps, but. Just hit the just hit one string. Like I don't know if you can tell what I'm doing here, but I'm just the top string. Let's go one, two, three, four, and then move it. And no joke, when I first learned how to do that, I just made the T shape because my name's Tim. So I started on the fifth fret of the second string and I, I do it four times, right? So I go up and then across. <laughs> I swear, dude. And I literally have like 10 songs. At Mark Dark, he'll tell you. <laughs> Dominic, dude, thanks for the donation. You guys are insane, dude. I almost cried earlier. Dorks. Parker Thompson McCoddle's in the house. Yes, Thompson, my young bro. Parker is the young bro. Hey, Parker, I watched um, I watched a bunch of your skate videos today. I saw the one where you hella slam, dude, and your camera guy's fired because it doesn't even show you actually like hit the rail. But dude, it looked like it hurt, man. I think you got hung up on, I think you're doing a 5-0 or a 50-50, and you slammed on that rail. It was like all metal. That whole park is metal, too. It's got to be a nightmare during the summertime, dude. Our park's all concrete, and it's like a bowl. So, like, the whole, you know, the park's up here, and there's, like, grass and chill area and some benches. And there's supposed to be a street course built in the back area, but then it's just a whole bowl. And you got, like, a dog leg. There's two, like, uh, there's a nine-foot wall with a roll-in, coping all the way around. Nice little pyramid in the middle with a crazy little, like, uh, I don't know what you'd call it. Like a quarter pipe, I guess. You got to come to Rip and do the park is fun to skate, man. I haven't skated in so long. Hell yeah, Dad. Hey, Dad, are you still in the chat? See, Villa Dope, that's Chris. And, and we've been trying to bring back Dad. Remember how you and Uncle Trace and everybody used to be like, hell yeah, Dad. You used to say Dad as, like, uh, in place of dude. We're trying to bring it back. Forever self employed. Send it over. Been waiting on that song. Villa Dope. Send it over. Send it over. That's actually so funny story. Justin and I actually got in touch. It's a, kind of crazy how we got in touch. So I made that song with Villa Dope. And then we dropped a song. I put it on one of my videos. And Justin's like, bro, that song. I want to get on that song. And that is how, like, a very beautiful friendship was born, dude, through music. So the power of music, you guys. So cool, man. And Justin. Boy, dude. Brandon. Five. I don't know what's happening. I missed that. I'm just going to keep going. When's the next music video? So, maybe for Gravity. I was thinking about filming one for Gravity. Uh, those are heck of fun to make, but I don't want to do them too much because I don't know. I don't have a good reason. I just don't know. Hey, thanks, bro. LMA. Oh, yeah. I've been into the hospital a few times. Oh, yeah. This is part of, part of the game. It's the name of the game, brother. Yeah, that park will melt your skin. Oh my god, dude. Everybody waiting on that. The Mercado, the Mercado collab. Is that what you're talking about, Justin? Oh, everybody's waiting on uh the po the gravity uh video. Yeah, Parker skates, a little shredder, dude. Sure am, Dad. Yeah, you remember that? So we're gonna bring that back, Dad. Dad. <laughs> it doesn't work when you're my dad. If I, if I say, oh, what's up, Dad? That doesn't work. Everybody's waiting on that Tim Parker. Oh, dude, you're going to blow the pop off the secret, Justin. Shh. Shh. Yeah, you guys. If you see Forever Self-Employed's comment, there might be a three-way collab coming up soon. 
Surf and skate. I wish I could surf. I'm going to learn how to surf this next summer. My boy, uh, dude, dude Does World, Andrew. Um, he has a YouTube channel, too. Dude Does World. He's going to teach me how to surf this summer. Just took my old skateboard to the skate park the other day and legit broke my board just doing a floor stair. Oh, <laughs> bummer. Maybe we should start a, uh, a vending machine skateboard line, you guys. What do you think? We need to pick a central location and all get together. Dude, I've been this since day one, dude. Let's do this. All the reseller channels have a get together. They all get together and do like a, they call it the green room or something, right? Why don't we do it called a rainbow room? Because hmm? you know, Skittles and gumballs. Uh, we need to take, yeah, dude, I agree with you, VinBiz. Uh, Chicago Kid Darius, where are you from? Where am I from? California, sir. I am from California, Central Valley, California. Uh, hammer smashed in between like uh, Modesto and Manteca. Uh, 60 miles south of San Francisco, or east of San Francisco, 60 south of, sorry, 90 miles east of San Francisco and 60 miles south of Sacramento, state capital or whatever, and like an hour west of Yosemite, so right right smack dab in the middle, man, I'm down for that Texas, I feel like Texas is like the middle, the middle ground, or like, so Arizona is like two states over for me. Texas, like three states over. Rainbow Room. I think another group of channels already has that one. <laughs> Probably, bro. Probably. Salvador Alvarez, welcome to the chat. Dude, he says, hello, Tim. Originally from L.A., but live in Idaho for almost 20 years. Okay, dude. So when people from California move out to Idaho, how does that make you feel? Because I had some uh, family move up there. And they straight moved back because they said that people just hated them. People hate people hate Californians, I guess, in, the, in Idaho. Is that true? Because I've never been. I've never been to Idaho. Mark Dark, if you're still on the chat, how many states have we been to? Because um, all the traveling I did was with him and our band Kings Up Today a, a couple hundred thousand years ago. All right, guys. <laughs> the gay runs out there. Yeah, I think so. The rainbows, bro, buddy. Brother Cho. How do I get my chat to just scroll down by itself? How do I, why do I got to keep touching it? What are all this stuff? What does all this stuff do? And why isn't Mark Sidow in the chat? All right, I'm playing their song I forgot to talk about. You guys threw me for a loop. I'll play, um, you guys want me to play a song? You guys care? I'll play a song. As long as it sounds good. Is the audio okay when I play guitar and sing? But January for sure, you guys, I'm getting some more vending machines because... Two ain't cutting it. I need to get a couple more. And uh, to be honest, though, I might, I might um, get the claw machine before I get another soda machine. But we'll see how it goes. So I don't know. Mark said this song. Let's see. Who cares if it's tuned? Um, I'll admit it hurt, and yes, I bled. Wait. I'll admit it hurt, and yes, I bled. That's not it. I'll admit it hurt, and yes, I bled a little bit. Nothing would taste better than revenge. I've lost my appetite, it was a bitter end. Some things are just better left unsaid. And to forgive, it's not to forget. And some things are just doomed when they begin. Take his note back home and tell my friends That I cannot go through all of that again And when you take all of my stuff back, tell my friends That I cannot go back to that prison again Now I take my time and I watch my every step I'm making sure that I don't cross no lines Living on this frozen lake and I'm always on thin ice And it's getting warmer all the time I better learn to swim I better do it quick Otherwise I'm gonna float just like a brick Take this note back home and tell my friends That I cannot go through all of that again and when you take all of my stuff back, tell my friends That I cannot go back to that prison again As you all celebrate, I slowly pace myself 
sitting back wondering what time will tell. An adversary of my state and an enemy of my mind. And every night it's a different fire to fight. I better learn to hide. God damn it. I better learn to hide. I better learn to run. Cause otherwise they're gonna see what I've begun. Take this note back home and tell my friends That I cannot go through all of that again And when you take all of my stuff back, tell my friends That I cannot go back to that prison again Alright, so what's going on here? Man, I'm so out of practice. <laughs> That's how my live shows go, usually, too. Alright, let me catch up with the chat. Catching up with the chat. Catching up with the chat. Oh my god. Oh, so, so what's up with Chrome Vending? I don't know, sir. I think actually Chrome Vending had um got out of the YouTube game just before I came in. I think because um I saw a lot of his videos, but I don't think I've ever actually seen like a new a new video from him since I've been on. Uh. Scroll down the bottom and catch up. I think it will auto scroll. Oh, okay. I'll do that. What's up with Chrome Vending Yell? Touched on that. I might be getting a vending machine soon at a school location. <gasps> That's awesome. Salvador Alvarez. It is true. I don't care. I still go home and visit. But a lot of people are moving from Cali that ain't going to stop. Damn. So, really, there's some hate out there for Californians. I'm not. I, that's a good song, Dad. Uh, sleepwalking. Chicago kid Darius, dope AF bro. I stay in Chicago. When I start YouTube and I want to some do some collab, yeah, let's do it, dude. I wanted to be the collab king, honestly, but you know, life and work. I want to make a documentary answering that question. Tim knows dough. Tim knows dough. He told me. Wait, that Donald dude. What are you saying, Brandon? I'm so confused. At Donald, dude, I want to make a documentary answering that question. Tim knows doe. Doe, like the female deer. They're going to build that fast train in Cali someday. I hope so. They've been talking about it since I was a kid, dude. What's up, everyone? Oh, you guys like the song? Thanks, man. I'm going to try to release another song before the year is done. So, I asked Jaime. I don't know if he's still in the chat, dude, but... I was like, I kind of had talked about making a music video and I have a whole video planned in my head, but I can't film it. But I like, I, I want it to be done like good. I want it to be done. Like the videos I'm doing is just playing around or right? I'm just screwing around because it's fun. But um, I want a real video. I want to make a real video. And I think Jaime could do that. He chimed in and was like, he's always kind of wanted to do something like that. And I've been working on a book that maybe one day I can turn it into a movie. It's kind of like my life, but just like over exaggerated. So yeah, if you guys want to... Let me know. I'll send you the link to the Google Doc. You guys can read it. Uh, hey, Brandon. Finbiz. Brandon Finbiz. I live close to the capital of Idaho. Finally expanding freeways to four lanes. Damn, crazy. Because we're all coming out there. Yeah, everybody go to Idaho. Go to Idaho. That way Salvador can move back to Cali. Yo, Azan's in the chat, dude. What's up, Azan? Doe like the ho. I don't know what you guys are talking about, dude. You guys are weird. When you do landscape, charge right. All right, talk to me. What do I charge? Say I'm just going to go do a mow and blow, the front and backyard, small, you know, normal, like, cookie cutter, like, you know, track home type type deal. I was thinking, like, 60 bucks a, 60 bucks a month. I don't know. You let me know, dude. And, and keep this in mind. Both of those accounts will, I could I could seriously walk there. I, I could literally walk there. Uh, Sapazan, doing homework. HBU. Let me see if I figure what that one means. Doing homework. HBU. <laughs> I have no clue, dude. I don't know what that stuff means. Brands at work? Ew, chilling at work. I like it. Static when I touch the phone? Really? That's trippy. How much battery I got? I got 24%, guys. So if it falls out, you know exactly what happened. 10-hour shift. Get it, dude. Get it. Your business is growing, though, so hopefully not much longer, bro. Tomorrow to work, Brandon. 80 a month weekly. 
80 a month and you go every week. Okay. I wasn't too far off then. Are you out here in Cali, Ramon? I've been in the Pocatello Hospital, Hair Care, and Tire Center. Dad, I don't know what you mean, dude. You gotta, you gotta type English, dude. And why are you yelling? <laughs> oh, how about you? Oh, I'm doing a live stream. <laughs> HBO is how about you? Okay, okay. I'll catch up one of these days. I'm old, guys. I know you guys. I'm old. I can't tell you I'm the oldest guy in this chat right now. I'll bet a dollar. I'll bet you a dollar. Bro, I might quit next year and focus more on my home biz and for sure, Dakota. Dude, Brandon, it's such a rough decision, but check it out. You know, I know there's a lot of people that say this, and I'm not the one that like invented this, but wait until your side hustle is making at least just as much or more, dude, you know? I mean, you could talk to Jamie Farnsworth about that because he was weighing the options of quitting and stuff before he actually pulled the trigger. You know, Reyes, obviously. I don't think I've ever had a real job, so yeah. So that's, uh, I'm, I'm kidding, I've had real jobs, but <laughs> uh, my circumstances, I've always had a side hustle on the side of my real job, and then eventually I just didn't have a real job. It wasn't like a, like a paramount, like, there was no, like, pinnacle, like, oh, I'm going to do it, I'm, I'm going to quit my job, you know, like, that didn't happen, it was, like, more of a situational thing. Like, I had a job, and I had my daughter, and, like, you guys know, like, she had some health issues when she was born, and for the first couple years, six years of her life was pretty, like, um, stressful and hard to be accountable because at any, you know, a lot of times we would drop everything and have to go to the hospital, which was in Palo Alto, which is about a um, little over a hundred, like 120 miles from where we live. So with that being said, like, I just, I only had my side hustles left. Like the only thing that I had left to bring in money. So I just had to kind of stick with it and just keep going. So I'm glad I did. Um, it's stressful, dude. Sometimes I wish I just had like a job. I could just go to work. Cause I feel like I work 50 times harder working for myself than I did when I had a job, like a, a job, you know what I'm saying? Like, I got to do everything, dude. I got to do everything, you know what I'm saying? I gotta schedule the appointments, take the phone calls, and call back, follow-ups, bids, the work, the, everything. And I don't always have people to help. Sometimes I got people to help, and I'm very fortunate. I got some good friends that are that know how to work and come out like Villa Doe. He comes out and helps a lot. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, that's brutal, dude. And sometimes they don't have work. And that's what, and that's how that goes, too. Sometimes you're like, shoot, I need to get some work, and you just don't have any work. But I got 20% of my battery, so we're going to have to start up, wrapping it up. So, yeah, you guys, truck, I'm hoping within the next week I get it back. I'm hoping I get it back before Christmas because I have a couple big exterior jobs that I'm waiting on. And I'm going to get some, uh, I'm going to try to get some drone shots on that, on that actual job. So, um, that should be cool, right? I would do the paint video and have the drone kind of chilling. Cause I got a buddy with the drone, so I think it cost me like a hundred bucks have him come out for the whole day or two days to come out and film, you know, for a couple hours each day. So one eight hour day, I can split it up. I don't know. I gotta hit him up and see what he's gonna charge me. But he actually filmed one of my music videos, bonus tracks for like under a bridge. There's like graffiti everywhere. He did that when he like first got that drone. I don't even know if it's the same one, but he's gotten real good at it. It's been about four or five years ago. So the trucks, we talked about the truck. So then um, the vending, definitely getting more machines. I'm not giving up. I know my collection videos suck because there's only like not very much money getting pulled out of them. But I think I found a way around it. I just need to get the right stuff in the dang machine. I got too much product in those machines that isn't moving, like isn't getting sold. So that's kind of the bummer because what's happening is it's almost like it's like a savings account for me. I just keep putting money in the machine and I just pull back like the same amount of money, even though, you know, it's full of drinks and sodas and I have backup inventory and all that. So, you know, yeah, dude. So I've, I mean, I think I'm about, so maybe I'll do a video. Maybe I'll do a video talking about how much I've made on the vending machine business, how much I put into it so far. And then maybe that would be good because I actually haven't done that. I just been flying by seat in my pants. I got stuff written down, but I actually haven't like crunched all the numbers. So I, I should go crunch all the numbers and maybe do a video, talk about how much I've made and go from there. Cause um, I know it's a few grand, which isn't a lot because dude, I got a claw machine for 150 bucks. Who the heck can do, who does that? I got lucky. It's probably somebody else's, um, somebody else paid for it, obviously, but I don't know who it was and I got it off offer up and I'm putting it to work, making it do what it's supposed to do.
So I want to get that machine cleaned up too. I talked about it, but man, that thing's hit or miss too. Sometimes it does 70 bucks every couple weeks and then sometimes it does like 10 bucks. So, all right, you guys. You guys are freaking amazing. Go watch Dominic Barbados video just dropped. I think everybody dropped the video today. Go watch everybody's videos, guys. Everybody in the chat, go watch. I got how much battery now? Oh, it's going down fast. I got 19%, guys. So, all right. I love you guys, man. I can't thank you guys enough for this crazy, like, chat thing that you guys got going. I think I have to thank Jaime to get that whole thing going. Uh, you guys are really amazing. It's going to definitely go straight into getting the truck fixed. I really do appreciate that. Uh, so, yeah. I'll see you guys in my next video. I got a video coming. I'll try to get it done by today. Um, today's been a weird day. I've been trying to get it done. It's hard to get motivated sometimes. All I got to do is drop the music. And um, real quick question. Do you guys like it when I put the like the conversation, the dialogue up on the screen? Or do you think it's just like distracting? Or do you want to just listen to yourself? Let me know what you guys think. Oh, I'm missing all kinds of freaking chat. What is happening? Dude, I'm missing a bunch of stuff here. Sorry, guys. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Let me try to catch up. Quick Play just dropped the video. Go watch Quick Play's video just dropped. At least I just got the notification. All right, guys. So let me see. I know a guy's 18 years older than you. Yeah, you, Dad. You dork. Let's go, Dakota. Need that YouTube money. Let's get Dakota up. Everybody go sub to Dakota. And when you go to work, put one of his playlists on uh, auto repeat. We got to get this guy's. We got to get this guy monetized. Thanks, Ed. I, I try, man. I try. Not always, but I try. Maybe one day. Let live, Tim. We got to step our game up. Yeah, we're stepping our game up. Hoy uh, todo bien, mi hermano. I don't know what that means, Carlos, but appreciate it. I guess I'll know what's happening. I need to get some mods. Uh, what kind of landscape equipment? Dude, just a mower and a blower and a weed whacker. All right, Ed. Dude, I love you, Dakota, man. Thanks for the donations, dude. You guys are awesome. Started with the go back logo. Yep, same thing. All right, Justin. Thanks, man. Sorry, I just it kind of went sideways. Tim, you rock, keep rocking. Yes, Ramon. Thank you, Dad. Love you, Dakota. Love you, Tony. Love you. Everybody go sell to each other. All right. Late. How do I stop it? Like that.